Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 7 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about Toaster. Toaster is a JavaScript library for non-blocking notifications. Uh, for using Toaster, jQuery is required. Okay, so let's see how we can use Toaster in Laravel 7. So switch to the project and here in the previous video, uh, we have created match cloud operation. Okay, in last video, we have created a teacher controller. This one. And uh, in this controller, uh, we have created cloud operation, image cloud operation. Okay, now I'm just going to add toaster with this. You can see here the project in browser. So just uh, right here teachers press enter this is the image cloud operation now i am going to use uh, add toaster with this okay so first of all add toaster cdn to the project so just open new tab and go to the google and here just type just search toaster okay now just uh, open first link all right just open this uh, toaster.mean.js and uh, toaster.mean.css so just open this link and uh, first of all copy this css and switch to the project and just uh, open here just go inside the resources folder and views then just open teachers.blade.php okay this one all right now here just add the style sheet css so just right here link rel is equal to style set right then hr here is equal to just paste here okay now just close now just copy the js cdn and uh, just paste here after this Okay, so just write your script src is equal to paste. Okay, this one. And now close the script. All right, now save the file and uh, jQuery has been added. Okay, now go to the teacher controller. So just open. Uh, inside the app directory http then controllers and just open teacher controller okay and here i'm just going to use uh, toaster with a store teacher function okay so just right here arrow with uh, record underscore added and just pass here the message which is new record has been created successfully okay Now go to the teachers.blade.php and here just add uh, first of all check if session colon colon edge this property uh, this one record added okay so just copy and paste here inside the single quote all right 
and here close the if so just write here in if okay and inside this if uh, just add this script tag okay and here uh, just write toaster dot success and inside this uh, double quote just write here curly bracket and exclamation sign full time and here just write session colon colon get single quote and just copy this and paste here all right okay now it's done so save the file and uh, okay now let's check so switch to the browser and uh, here just refresh the page okay now just click on add new uh, let's say name it's on and uh, browse an image select first one now click on open now click on submit and you can see here the toaster message okay now add this toaster uh, notification to the update okay so go to the teacher controller and uh, here just add with update teacher function just write here with with record updated okay and uh, here just write here the message and record has been updated successfully. All right. Now just go, uh, go to the teachers.blade.php and here just copy this and paste here and just copy this record updated. And here just paste also here okay first check the uh, session as record updated or not if, uh, uh, if available then just print this okay now save the file and also save the controller all right now let's check so switch to the browser and just edit uh, I'm just going to edit this uh, first of all refresh the page okay and now click on edit I'm just going to change the name Zeni and uh, change the image uh, this one Okay, now click on submit okay you can see here the record has been updated okay and last uh, let's add the toaster with the delete operation so switch to the controller and uh, just add here with this method delete teacher and just add here with record deleted okay so simply write here the record deleted okay now just write here record a message uh, record has been deleted successfully all right save the file and this is to the teachers.blade.php and here just copy this and paste here now change the uh, this ename so just to go to the teacher controller and just copy this record deleted 
and paste here okay also change this now save the file and uh, let's check the switch to the browser and just refresh the page now just click on delete and you can see here the poster notification record has been deleted successfully all right so in this way you can use toaster in laravel 7 so that's all about toaster notification so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching